What's up guys, it's me Jeremy. With all of the changes to trinkets, it's pretty clear that the new upgraded trinkets are really, really strong, and honestly give you a huge advantage over players who do not upgrade them. Let's get started. With the changes to trinkets, the amount of value you get out of your cheap upgrade of a mere 250 gold honestly is probably the most efficient and most valuable 250 gold you'll ever spend throughout the entire game. Players hit level 9 around 15 minutes or so, and you should be upgrading your trinkets honestly on your first back after hitting level 9. They're just that good. Let's break down each trinket individually. For the Greater Stealth Totem, it now gives you a full 3 minute ward that is on a cooldown of only 60 seconds, not to mention that it actually lets you store 2 charges. Because of the feature that lets you hold a ward, you will easily be using this trinket every 70 to 80 seconds or so. Let's be generous and assume you'll place a ward every 90 seconds with this. Even with that, it would still only take 5 minutes for the trinket to pay for itself, and everything after that is just free cash money. Not to mention that it's extremely slot efficient, and you won't have to save an inventory space for wards. Honestly, I never thought I would say this, but the amount of wards that you get from this trinket is honestly enough to where you probably don't have to buy additional wards, with of course the exception of pinks. Now between the two, I would definitely say that the Greater Stealth Totem is reasonably more useful than the Greater Vision Totem, but either way, the Greater Vision Totem gives you a full-blown pink ward on a 2 minute cooldown. Now I would definitely recommend getting the Greater Stealth Totem most of the time and just buying pink wards, but that doesn't change the fact that for only 250 gold, this item gives you pretty much unlimited pink wards for the rest of the game. If your team does not need extra wards, picking this up can be a great option for controlling vision, as quite often you might find yourself using 4, 5 or even more pink wards as the rest of the game goes on. For the Oracle Lens, it gives you the Oracle effect that lasts for 6 seconds while also giving you 10 seconds of true sight on a cooldown of 75 seconds. Honestly, every single team should always have a version of this trinket, at least one. It's so incredibly key for taking objectives and fighting in the jungle, and with a cooldown of just 75 seconds, you can easily clear 10 or even more wards with this item the longer the game goes on. And of course, don't forget the added worth of knowing for sure that your opponent does not have vision in a specific area, which can be somewhat priceless sometimes. And lastly, for the far side lens, although it is a bit more situational than the others, if you're in a spot to where you are going to buy a scrying orb in the first place, the fact that the upgraded version, the far side lens, now places a ward is actually fantastic because it really helps in what the orb is trying to do, which is for face checking bushes and checking choke points to see if they're dangerous. And due to the fact that it reveals any player's scene for 6 seconds, you're going to try to use it to find someone in an unknown, dangerous dangerous area or to give vision while fighting, but now if you miss completely and you don't see anyone, you will still get a ward, which is amazing because you'll then be able to see if someone walks through that area even 30, 40, up to 60 seconds later, which is amazing for doing what the Farsight Lens is trying to accomplish in determining whether or not a specific area is dangerous. Anyways, that just about wraps it up. My name is Jeremy, and that's it for my video on the upgraded trinkets. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button so I can tell, and be sure to check me out over on all the socials of which you can see on your screen. And if you really enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe for some more awesome content in the future, or check out some of my other videos on your screen as well. And above all else, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. This video was sponsored by Vulcan. Fantasy draft the LCS for money and win big, or play for free and win some pocket change. Use the code GAMINGCURIOS to support me, and Vulcan will match all deposits you make up to $1,000.